We start tonight with the latest on the search for a missing Iowa State student in a lake in Hamilton County. According to Iowa State University, five students from the Iowa State Crew Club went out rowing on Little Wall Lake right here. It's off Highway 69 in Hamilton County. Their boat capsized. Three of those students were rescued. The body of another student was recovered, and the search is still underway for the fifth student. Local 5's John Diaz is in Hamilton County at Little Wall Lake right now. John, where you've been all day long. Yeah, that's right. Uh, the search uh, for these students has been going on all day. They called it off around 730. But while we were here, we saw boats on the water. We saw the divers as well. A number of agencies involved in these recovery efforts. And we spoke with the sheriff of Hamilton County, who tells us the conditions on the water this morning were rough. A 911 call coming into Hamilton County at around 930 Sunday morning of a boat capsized on Little Wall Lake. On that boat, five members of the Iowa State University Crew Club. At the time that the call came in, there was pretty good northwest winds. We're guessing anywhere from 20 to 25 mile an hour winds, and the, rough, the lake was pretty rough. Three of those students making it out alive, thanks in part to what the Hamilton County Sheriff says are heroes. There some people took some risks that they didn't have to take and save some lives. Can you talk about that? I mean, did they, were people in the water trying to help? There was people who got in the water and went out there and helped. So this could have been a lot worse than what it is, what it's going to be. Those three students were treated and released, expected to be okay. The body of a fourth student was later recovered. The search for the fifth continuing past sundown with the help of the Story County dive team. Their boats methodically combing the water. They were just one of about a dozen different agencies helping with the incident. And we're just learning tonight that when the 911 calls came in, witnesses could see all five students in the water by the time uh, deputies and police officers arrived, only three students were visible. Now the search for the body of the fifth student will continue tomorrow morning. And of course the investigation into the cause of all of this is ongoing. For now, we're live in Hamilton County. John Diaz, Local 5 News, we are Iowa. Thank you so much, John. And reporter Khalil Maycock will be there tomorrow morning as the search commences. Iowa State's President Wendy Winterstein says the community is heartbroken to learn of this tragic incident. She said tonight in a statement, we ask that everyone keep them in their thoughts during this very difficult time.